everyone, welcome back to Cravings Food Adventures. I'm Karen Ahmed. Today I'm going to show you how to make these delicious salmon cutlets. They're so easy to make, they're very economical, and I'm making them in my air fryer. This is going to be healthy, fast, and cheap. I'm going to start with the canned salmon. I'll be using three cans, and this is 213 grams each. That's a total of 639 grams. Drain all of the water. Heat some oil and add one cup of diced onion, two tablespoons of finely minced red chilies, and two tablespoons of minced garlic. Saute everything. Next, I'm going to add the salmon in. This salmon has some skin and a center bone, so I will remove these. Next, I'm going to add one tablespoon of paprika. I'm also going to add one tablespoon of cumin powder, a half tablespoon of pepper and a half tablespoon of salt. And I'm going to mix this in. I have boiled and mashed five medium potatoes. These are approximately one pound and 12 ounces. That is 804 grams. I will mix this in a little bit at a time. You don't have to use all of the potato if you don't want to, but I love to keep this economical. I'm also going to add a half cup of chopped parsley and a half cup of parmesan and I'm going to mix this in. Now I'm going to grab a golf sized ball and I'm going to form these into patties. These will make about 24 to 26 patties. I have one cup here each of flour and breadcrumbs and two eggs. I will add more if I need it. Dip each patty in the flour, then the egg and then the breadcrumbs. Because I'm going to air fry these, I will only prepare as many as will fit in my air fryer. Turn the air fryer on and allow it to run for about a minute or two so it's nice and hot. I'm going to spray the air fryer with some oil and I will add as many that will fit. These salmon cutlets are cooked from the inside, so we just need the egg wash to cook and the breadcrumbs to crisp up. These will take 8 to 12 minutes to get nice and brown and they will need to be flipped in between. Spray the cutlets with oil in between. These make a great appetizer, snack or side. They are economical and while you can make these in the oven or shallow fry them, I like the drier texture you get from the air fryer. 